Hi YouTube, right this is a, a video tutorial to uh, set up Docker uh, engine on Ubuntu into Azure. So if you want to click on the link in the description it will take you straight to the Azure Marketplace Docker template that we're going to use. So all you're going to do is click on get it now, hit continue and this will take you through the steps to set up a, uh, a fresh Ubuntu server with the Docker community engine installed. So let's set up. So in this screen, this takes you through the steps to create the virtual machine. So we're going to create a uh, resource group to put the virtual machine in, and then we're going to give it a virtual name, region North US. Authentication type, you can use public key. In this example, I'm just going to use a username and password. And then default ports, so port 22 for the uh, SHH disks. We'll leave all on the default. Default again. You can use an existing VNet if you want. Just going to disable the boot diagnostics. I don't need that. Hit next. And then review and create. And then the last screen. Hit create. Then that will go ahead, build the virtual machine. Once the machine is loaded up, you simply log in via your SHH terminal you'll be able to log in and it's ready to go, we'll have the docker engine installed so we'll let that run now for a, probably run for a minute or so, I'll pause the video and then we'll see and then we'll we'll actually log in and have a look okay we're back now, it didn't take too long so you'll see this screen, just click on go to resource you'll see the virtual machine so I'm just going to get the IP address of it and I use uh, Putty so it's a free download just Google download Putty install that and then you'll be able to log into your new Ubuntu server so put that in there open that would do an SHH connection to the server and then you log in and I'm logged in now. So as I said previously the docker en engine is already installed so you're pretty much ready to go start building your docker containers. Just to confirm that docker is installed I'll just do a a quick demo to, to run the hello world docker container so run that and then a couple of seconds later You'll see it successfully pulled down the image and built a demo Docker container. That's it. So I hope that works. Any problems or questions, just leave a comment below. And again, you can get access to this image within the description of this video. And if you liked it, hit a like and subscribe. Thanks very much.